This tutorial is designed to show you how to create a test in Blackboard 9. This tutorial will cover adding tests, creating questions, and then deploying these tests. So the first thing that we'll do is we'll go to Blackboard 9 into a content area and we'll click on create assessment and down to test. Now we're going to use the create feature here and when we do that we have to give this test some title or name. So I'm going to call it test 2 and I can give it a description for instance how many times they could take the test or um, when the test is due. I might put due date and I will you have two attempts. I can give some instructions on what they need to do when they're once they deploy the test if I'd like also. I'm going to hit submit and this will bring me into the test canvas area where I can, can add questions. Now the first question type I'm going to add is a multiple choice and you don't have to give it a question title but you do have to give it put, type in a question. For instance how many months are in one year? Then I can put the answers below. So I can put 5, 12, 1, 6. And now you have to tell Blackboard what the correct answer is. So I'm going to put 12, answer 2. And the last thing, if I want to give any feedback, like if they get the answer correct or incorrect, I can put feedback down here. like. Okay. Go, or I might tell them if they get an incorrect response where they might go to find the answer, like read chapter two. And then I hit submit. Now by default these questions have a point value of 10. If I want to change that I click on that and I can put in whatever ever value I want. Now I've created one test with one question with the total points of five, I could continue doing this adding different types of questions. If you want this to grade itself, you need to pick the questions that can do that, like multiple choice and true and false. Now when I click OK, this is where I have to put hit submit after I selected the test that I just created. But now I have to deploy the test. And deploying the test, the only thing I have to make sure that I do is click this make this link available and I said that they could have two attempts so I'm going to click multiple attempts and I'm going to put a two in here. Now there are other features that you can ha put in here like forcing completion or putting a timer. I might display this until a certain date just so that but in the description I'd have to put when that due date is. Now I want them to see their submitted answers and the feedback and then what I do is I just hit submit. And again, there are lots of other features you can play around with within Blackboard. Now, when I go to the student view and I click on assignments, you'll see the test is here. And when they click on it, they can begin the test and they're presented with the questions. So I will click 12 for how many months are in one year. And then I hit save and submit. And then when the student clicks OK, it will show them immediately that they got five out of five points, that they got the right answer, and then the feedback will be right there. Now as an instructor, if you go to the Grade Center, you can actually see the progress of your students. So I can see on my test two, the student had five points. Thanks for watching this tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it.